Welcome to another episode of Weird Beard Fishing, y'all. Today I'm going to do something that I've never really done, other than a few times in a pond with my grandpa when I was a little kid. I went out and I bought myself a little cheap fly rods head up. It's just one of those, you know, like $30 little kits that you'd see at uh, Walmart, Myers, or whatever you got around you. Uh, a cheap little setup. And then I also got a few little flies. And I'm going to try seeing a little fly kit. Let's put that in my pocket with some pliers and go waiting. Because I also got a great deal on a set of neoprene waders and boots during Black Friday sale. Which happened to be my birthday. So it was a pretty good day. And uh, so I'm going to try and get out here. And see if I can find find some rainbow trout that live here. I think this is one of the few places in southern Ohio that has any trout year round at all other than the ponds and small lakes that they stock with stalker trout in the spring and then they die off. This body of water always has trout in it. So I'm going to get the waders on, get everything all rigged up, and let's get out there and see if I can do this whole fly fishing thing. So this first little spot I rolled up on, there is a bunch of trout stacked up here. And it looks like a few of them are pretty decent size. Oh, there's one right in front of me. Oh man, I want to get down here, but I don't want to spook them. That, and there's a tree over top of my head. I mean, they are stacked up right here. Oh, they know I'm here. Oh, they're going for it. Kind of. To me, it looks like they don't really like this color. I'm gonna change it out here. Man, they are stacked up right here. I'm telling you, I can see like at least 15 to 20 of them right here. Really, somebody sees me fishing right here and they stop. Oh, there was one going for it. Got one. No way. No way. Yes. That is awesome. 
my first trout and the first thing on the fly rod that I've ever caught on this. That is awesome. Oh, where am I gonna go? Cause I gotta go get my hands wet. Oh, don't you go anywhere, buddy. Let me get up over here. Sneaky, sneaky. Come here, buddy. Get my hands wet and I'll get you off. Get you off in a second. Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. I'll let you go. Oh, that's awesome. There's a whole shitload of them sitting right here. Yeah, probably about. 30 or 40 of them. I Yeah, there's actually quite a few uh, decent sized ones. Good. I just got my first one ever, actually. Really? Hey, yeah. yeah. It's fun, ain't it? Yeah, it'll be a video on YouTube. Yeah, what's your channel? Weird Beard Fishing. Weird Beard Fishing. Yep, I'm a, yeah, I make videos all over the place here. Cool, man. Awesome. That's a little fly that worked. If you guys can see that, figured it'd work because a little bit of a little bit of weight on the front of it. And those fish seem to be sitting down pretty low. Oh man, how did that happen? Somehow got a tiny little knot in my line. I don't want that. Man, you definitely can't see the fish as well on this side. I know they're still there. I think I finally found another deep hole that has some trout in it. Ooh. Yep, I just saw another trout. See if there's some trout up in here. Well, guys, I only got that one fish. I, you know what? I say that's not bad for the first time of trying to fly fish, so. You know, it is what it is. I did have a lot of follows and I could move fish, but they just didn't want to commit. And then I had a few on that jerk bait that came up, swiped at it, but I couldn't get anything hooked up. So I'll catch you guys next time on the next episode of Weird Beard Fishing.